Yo, friend and family, this is Jay again today. I want to show you what we are doing and where I cannot. Um, I don't know, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say today. We traded, but we lost, so we lost one, one, uh, one, uh, one, one pair which is usd jpy then we chose to delete it but um yeah it didn't reach our level of, then we chose to delete it we didn't lose anyway we deleted it because market uh failed to break the direct i mean the zone it's fair to break the zone so our level market didn't trigger it so guys um i'm recording this video just to tell you uh what's behind uh this trade that we took today right um thank you using this this uh, strategy i know most of you are waiting are still waiting for the video of one minute of scalping strategy um the scalpers are still waiting for me actually but I will use this five minute time frame to tell you what is behind of this trade. And everyone we understand why we took trade and we understand how you can use it to scalp. Either you scalp with one minute or five minutes, you can see that we are using five minutes here. So it will be easy for everyone to understand how it works. So when you are trading with this strategy, you have to go for two or three things, guys. Two or three things. So, number one. Number one of what you have to follow before you take a trade. Like, you are you're analyzing market. You want to know the direction of the market, right? The first thing that we consider, you have to check. First of all, you have to check this micro line, which is a 0 0.0000 what, 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 what. You can see it's dividing this area and down one. You have to check it first. After checking it, you have to, to check if market has passed is above of the line or is below of the line so when the market approaches this line it means exactly it's in bullish when it it approaches from above it means that it is in bearish so how do you know that is is going to keep on selling or it's going to keep on buying and how do you exactly confirm a trade right this is our question here now, which is going to be answered. First of all, if you can zoom out once, right? You can zoom out once. You can see this red line from here. When it comes below, it just went out of this red, this green area. You can see that be, uh, between red line and this green area, there is a white gap. There is a wide gap. If you can just zoom twice, you can see it clearly. So now, zoom in. Uh, just if you zoom in twice, let's go back and check from this area. When you come to this area, you will realize that when this uh, line goes and break this line, this uh, micro line, you will realize that the, the green line are getting longer, longer, longer as market goes on, right? You uh, will realize that. So now, if you check, double check, there is no that white, white gap here. There is no that white gap here. So that white gap shows up when the bulls uh, enter in the market. Otherwise, when the when, when sellers are, in, are controlling the market, the red line will be trending inside of green area. All right so when this green green uh, when this red line comes to jump out of green area you can see it will start creating a gap white gap inside here you can see is visible uh, you can just zoom in, zoom out again you can clearly see that there is a white area between right so when this uh, white area starts showing up you will realize that 
Now, those lines that were coming longer, longer, longer are now starting to, to be created shorter, shorter, shorter. As market goes up, as this line goes up, the line becomes shorter, all right? It means what? It means that when this line jumps out of the market, jumps out of the green area, it is now a time to do what? To buy, right? So if you are scalping, imagine it jumps from here. So now check from this side. If you could have bought from here until when the market just went up, it just went up. This was pullback. You can see it was before it just approached our middle line, as I said. And then the market just gave us a pullback and then went up again. All right. So let's go back and talk about this again. I didn't finish this. So when this line comes out of green area, when you check up, you will realize that this... Uh, these parabolic lines dots that are coming from above will stop now to be drawn from above now they will start uh, shows up from below once it starts showing this uh, from below and this has jumped out of the green area it's just started giving you a white white space there you know that this is second confirmation that you have to do what to buy so now if um, you still need another confirmation, you will just wait for this moving average 100. So once this moving average 100 just approached to the chart here, <coughs> it means straight that it's not going to go back. It's going to jump. So market will have to go above and this uh, moving average will have to, to move below the chart. This is the third confirmation. So if you are uh, a pattern trader, who knows too much pattern or depends on the patterns, uh, sometimes it's good to wait for a certain signs after this happens. Market can give you uh, different patterns, can give you maybe, let's say, bullish and girlfriend. Yeah, it's, it's strong, but it's not that strong like... Uh, if market maybe gives you um, like a bullish pacing, right? Or if it's, it gave you maybe double bottom, all right? Or it gives you, you know, there's a lot of things that market can create here to just give you the last sign that you have to buy. So from there, guys, uh, those signs are enough. This is the first one that is happens from this side. You could have just bought from this side. It's just a matter of market to come and set a uh, support here. But this was a good sign, and this was a good sign. That's how you have to analyze with this strategy. And then you just go to 15 minutes and check what's going on. Uh, so you know that you're not gonna you go no, you're not gonna stay longer in a market since you're trading with the five minute or or, or one minute. So if you were scalping from here, from this side until here, there's enough money you could have got out of the market. And then when market started showing up from above, parabolic started showing up from above, you just cross immediately. And when the market comes, uh, moving average comes and just jump above of this, and then immediately you are out. And when MACD jumps on this, um, middle line what you have to do is to take a profit first take profit so second you will close when this uh, red line comes out of this area and start showing if you zoom out it will start showing um, a white space in between so from here you know that you are out these three things that you must consider to go out of the market the same thing we consider to set to start a uh, buying or selling so if you were to buy then your market stopped from there so now when these parabolic stars are showing from above and when moving average has passed uh, across above uh, these charts and when this red line jumps out of green area and start giving you a gap white gap between 
at this green area and red line then you know this is a confirmation that i have to sell so this is for you guys who want to trade for five minutes scalpers so or oh, for us who doesn't scalp i will still have explanation enough but then if you um you are clever enough you will understand how you can trade and hold your trades with the same strategies you can clearly see that uh, entry signs are everywhere so guys today uh i think we're not gonna talk uh too much about this we can just uh stop from here and then wait till we we uh keep on talking about this monday because we still have a long way to go so this is what we did in our vip group uh have did the same so it's not that big difficult if you know or you understand price action you can combine this with price action or you can you can combine this with my other strategy which is this one let me show you another strategy uh here i'm trading nsdjpy you can see that it's giving me 100 so you can just combine uh with this strategy it will give you a good profit it will give you a, it will give you a good direction it will be easy for you to understand how um, you can take in sniper entry so you can choose to combine that strategy with one of these to just uh, confirm uh, the entry point so or you can combine it with your own strategy that you know that it's working for you uh, as long as you're gonna make money that's cool so guys let me say enjoy your weekend i'm going to go ahead and close with this and then and wait for monday to come because we are done we traded five or oh, five 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 pairs but five signals but one didn't manage to reach our level where we wanted to to buy it from so we consider it as as we lost it we didn't get any money from it but anyway we didn't even lose money from it so let's go guys and enjoy our weekend i wish you all the best if you are if it's your first time to visit our channel guys just don't hesitate to go there and just hit that subscribe button and hit like and share so every time you upload a new video you can get a notification so this is the story of friday enjoy your day guys bye bye